doesn't love AI prompt templates. I know I do, and I actually don't like using other people's templates. In a lot of cases, I end up gutting them completely and rewriting my own. So in this week's video, I'm gonna show you the five ChatGPT templates that I use every single month slash every single week of my life because they are so helpful and I have developed all of them. So the number one method of using ChatGPT in my business is actually to help me to create a content plan for this YouTube channel, which then stems out to my blog and my social media channel and everything else. So without further ado, I wanna show you my prompt template and what it looks like for creating a 30 day content plan for your YouTube channel or your blog. Okay, so this next one is a social media calendar prompt. The template is in the library, but I already have this one filled out and ready to go. So I'm gonna copy this prompt and I'm gonna put it into ChatGPT and hit enter because this is fully customized already with what I want. It's going to go ahead and create that 30 piece of content outline for me to then customize for my own schedule for social media. So it's gonna give me um, the main topic, the format, if I'm putting text on the screen, a basic caption, a couple hashtags I can use, and then what post type it's gonna be because my strategy for social media is different based on what I actually wanna promote for the week. So if you scroll the table to the right, you'll see a post type and then a schedule. So when should this go out? Um, this is going to then filter through carousels, reels, and a couple of other post types that I care about, which are like promoting lead magnets or promoting paid products that I wanna create. But then I'm just basically taking this and I'm copying it and putting it into a spreadsheet so I can manipulate it and then go on to actually create all of this content for the month. But now I'm not actually having to come up with all of this. So if you have a content plan you already have mapped out, you can input that into the prompt for the post types or the content types that you want it to promote for the month or the extra things. So as you go through this template, you'll notice I want it to have these kind of videos and I want these videos to be X, Y, and Z or on this topic. Um, and then it's going to develop that for you. So you have to be just really specific with the prompts that I'm giving you in the library, um, but this one will then create a full month of social media content for you. Next up is the social media content plan for 30 days. Based on what I create in my YouTube channel and blog, I then use this template to create social media content that I can then repurpose or just put everywhere. So with that being said, this is how I create using ChatGPT a full 30 day social media content plan. What content to create for their website or create for their YouTube channel. And that's why I created this ChatGPT prompt to actually create a content plan for me. Now this is a multi-layered prompt template. It not only is the long form content um, prompt, but it's also a prompt about who you are as a business owner and what you want um, people to get from your products, from your services, from your content. So it's my AI prompt called the Who Am I prompt or about, about your business one pager. And I kind of pair those two prompts together. So I'm gonna copy and paste this one into a new chat on ChatGPT. And it's gonna to put together a um, content strategy for me for the next three months. Now, I've very specifically in this prompt told it what I'm gonna be focusing on over the next few months. And then it's going to create some YouTube content um, ideas or how-to videos or authority-based videos awareness-based videos that I can then put into my schedule and I can make outlines and do additional research on these to validate these ideas and that this is in fact what I want them to do. So it's giving me my main topic, my format, my outline, and this is really just a basic outline and a very basic video caption. Now with ChatGPT, I can take this and I can tell it, I want you to take this caption and expand it and then use my YouTube description prompt to actually create a full YouTube description for each video. So that is my YouTube outline and how to create a full content plan for your YouTube channel or your website. Now, I do wanna say that all of these prompts are available in my AI resource library, which we're gonna to get to in a moment. However, 
A lot of them are actually available in my free resource library, including the next one that we're gonna talk about, which is the pin titles and descriptions. Prompts three and four are actually used every single week to create Pinterest titles and Pinterest descriptions. Now I'm not gonna show you the back end of this template like I just did the other two because I've talked about it on this channel before. So if you wanna learn how to use ChatGPT for your titles and descriptions, head on over to the description and that video is linked there. However, I use it every single week to create new titles and new descriptions for all of my Pinterest pins. Now I will say a little side note, it's a secret, okay? You can use these ChatGPT prompts in Canva Magic Write, especially the pin titles and descriptions. Now I haven't found the content plan templates to work quite as well, but they do work to some effect, to some degree. I do prefer ChatGPT over Canva Magic Write for the content plans though. All right, so if you're liking this video so far, can you give it a big thumbs up for me? Because it'll reach more people just like you. All right, moving on is the YouTube description prompt. I love this prompt actually, and I created it out of desperation because I was so sick of writing my own YouTube descriptions that I just created the prompt just a few weeks ago. So this prompt is actually going to be based on all of my keyword research that I do for each video. I use that keyword research. I use the topical keyword that I want to show up in the first sentence of the description. And then I plug all that information into the prompt. So here's how that one works. My YouTube descriptions, and you don't wanna stick it in and actually not convert and put your keyword phrase in, but like for example, this week's YouTube video or Pinterest tactics that are working right now. So what I would do is I would go in and insert that information. And then I would put in the keywords that I wanna use. So let me just stick those in. Don't make my mistake of not hitting shift enter. Once you're done entering your keywords in, then make sure that you choose a keyword phrase that you want it to hone in on. And then once you're done with the template itself, you hit enter and it's going to create a YouTube description for your video. Once it's done with the description, I'm actually going to edit this. I would take this and put this in my YouTube creator studio like description box and edit this for my voice, put enters in like enter and break up the lines so it's actually smaller paragraphs of text. And I would then, once I'm finalized with it, also put that into my ClickUp task for my team to be able to use for any meta descriptions, anything on the website that they wanted to use. And I also tend to use this um, or edit this for Pinterest descriptions as well if I'm feeling like I wanna do that. Now there is another template we'll talk about for Pinterest. Okay, so let's talk about the AI resource library that I have available. I have two versions available. I have the free resource library where the Pinterest descriptions and title resource is available to you, as well as the Pinterest trends, ChatGPT prompt, and some others like the Who Am I one pager that I um, use in my content plan and my social media plan. That is a multi-stage prompt. That one is in the free resource library as well as a TikTok description template. Um, and a few other things. Now in the AI resource library, which I recently created for my membership, I had a few people reach out via email and ask if they could get access to that without actually joining the full membership. Now, if you're like them and you can't afford the $37 a month, or you're not quite ready for a full membership of that nature, because it is a lot, and you just want access to my AI templates and everything new that I create every single month, which is anywhere between four to six new templates every single month go in there. I am inviting you to join the AI template membership. It is five bucks a month and you get access to all the templates that are already in there, including the content plan, the social media content planning template, my YouTube description template and more. And I'll be adding more content in there every single month. So in the description of this video are gonna be a few links for you. Link number one is gonna be the pin title and description chat GPT video. Number two is gonna be the free resource library and number three will be the paid resource library for five bucks a month. I made it super cheap. That way, if you just wanna join and grab the templates that are in there, you can do that and I can also get compensated for a little bit of the work that I do for you here on the channel. Now, with that being said, I want you to head on over here and watch these ChatGPT videos and I'll see you over there.